my name is Danny Deliberto, founder of Ladles of Love. It was founded back in 2014. The communities we, s we work with are all over the peninsula and um, we're working with 138 beneficiaries now. We've grown exponentially. Um, we've been able to do that because of all the kindness that we have experienced um, from individuals and corporates such as uh, Interbet who just want to be part of the change. Race number three is the start of the pick six on Wednesday at Hollywood Best Gravel on the Poly Track. It's a Phillies and Mayors 83 handicap of the 1,000 meter trip. 25 past one is the off time. And your favorite is number seven, Kennedy at three to one. La Premiere is at seven to two. Number five, War Empress at nine to two. 11 to 2 about patterns here. It's uh, 11 to 2 rapid fire. Most in Scotland has found support 10 to 1 into 7 to 1. And then numbers 1 and 6 are both at 8 to 1 in the market. It's a field of 8 runners that will line up at this point in time. As we do mention on a regular basis when we do go through these uh, selection shows, do take note of scratchings, any changes uh, closer to race time before making your final, uh, before placing your final bets. Now, race number 3, Kennedy. Horse number seven is the top selection for me. I've banked her in the place accumulator. She's a daughter of William Longsaw that's won four times. And she's a filly that has got a mind of her own. So uh, on race day, things can just go horribly wrong if you are in a camp. And uh, she can play up. She can get her head off uh, above herself. And she can, she can do things wrong. But if her mind is on the job, as it has been of late, I think she's going to be hard to beat in this contest here. She's uh, a horse that has certainly turned the corner ever since uh, coming through to KZN. She's won three out of her last four starts and a narrow victory in a penultimate start behind Le La Premiere. Now she's got La Premiere held at the weights and I can't see La Premiere turning that form around with her. She's uh, course and distance suited, four wins all over the 1,000 meter trip and I think she's going to be able to ping those gates, get to the head of affairs, and um, I think Serena Moodley, given that he knows her well, I think he'll be able to shepherd her to victory. So she's going to be the top selection for me and a banker in the place accumulator. Sheldon, your top choice here is uh, the horse that we've been for before and, and the horse that, as we mentioned, off air should have never got beat four starts back. But uh, it is a jockey strike with Richard Furry taking the right. So, I mean, you've obviously got to give her healthy respect. My only concern would, would be the poly track. I, I think she's better in a straight line at Hollywood Best Scottsville. But um, in saying that, her last start was a fairly fair, fair effort when second to Hartpole, who was actually quietly fancied on the day. And regardless of her being fancy, she went off at a generous price. Yes, looking at number four, Rapid Fire, as you mentioned, we're still having nightmares about that day when we backed her down from eight to one down 28 to 10. She should never have got beat on that occasion. Unfortunately, she's quite stuck in the merit ratings. Dropped a point from her last run when she was absolutely smashed by a hot pearl, so she races off a 76. She hasn't won in 1,025 days, so she's low on confidence. There are quite a few chinks in her armour, but in her favour, she was once upon a time a 103, and I think the booking of Richard Free is going to make the world of difference. She's been ridden by apprentices and other riders, but when Richard Free jumps aboard a steed, he gets the best out of him, and I'm going to give Rapid Fire the benefit of the doubt. She's going to look terrific on the way down to the start, and I just see Richard Faree turning it in the favour of her. So I'm going to go number four, Rapid Fire, from number seven, Kennedy, who has certainly blossomed, winning three out of her last four. She's an absolute distance specialist. All four of those wins been achieved over the distance. And then when you look beyond those runners, number three, Le Premier. Absolutely slammed, almost nine lengths, but given five points last time out. So let's see how she goes. And then a horse like number one, Pelagonium, is worth a mention. But the horse to beat will be number seven, Kennedy, on the recent form. But number four, Rapid Fire, I think Richard Free will make the difference. Yeah, certainly could make all the difference with a six-year-old daughter of Karari. So that's race number three, four and seven, the two horses that you can play around. Sheldon likes four. I'm in the cap off for number seven, and let's see how race number three unfolds. My name is Beston. I live in Cape Town. Also, I do uh, delivery. Interbet helped me to realize my dreams. Now I have my own delivery vehicle and I'm able to do the removal in and around Cape Town.